may have been going through the dark phase of lockdown on and off. And by now, even the kids know how important the use of face mask is. So I thought it's better to let go some stress by showing you how to make a food illusion cake. I have been planning to make realistic cake for ages. And now here it is. I present you my version of mask cake. Welcome back to Tales of Kids. I'm Sri Devi. I'm pretty sure you're gonna love today's video. Before heading to the video, make sure you subscribe my channel, share the realistic cake with your friends and family. Let's get started. I have already made a thin layer of flat cake. So first I'm gonna do is cut the top portion and level out our cake. I have taken a rectangular butter paper and I am going to use this as a guide and cut 3 layers out of this cake. Now let's stack our cake on top of each other using whipping cream. When I put the third layer, I felt the cake was way too big, so I decided to put just two layers of this cake. Now I'm going to trim the cake. We are keeping the top parts and slightly trimming the sides off. You can even use a real mask for your reference. Just try to cut the cake close to a tiny mountain shape. Once we are happy with the shape of the cake, crunk out it and refrigerate for about 10 minutes. While frosting is in the fridge, let's start coloring our fondant. What I have here is white fondant which I am going to turn into blue and also keeping some white fondant to make the elastic of the mask. A top or two of blue color is well enough. You need to make it big as we are going to fold and place the fondant to replicate the folding of the mask. Placing our blue fondant at the base of the cake, spread some fondant then we are gonna do the first fold like this. Using the same process, make the second and the third fold. Like 
Now let's cut out the excess fondant. Let's add a string to our cake. Using the help of a modeling tool, press the end of the fondant, making it seem as it glued onto the mask. I used three toothpicks and taped them like this. So slightly press and make these tiny impressions just as in the mask. Now tilt the toothpick slightly press along the sides. You can use a modeling tool or a fork for this but I find simple method like this are much easier and time effective. Hey, look at our final mask cake. Isn't it impressive? You can use it as a cake topper or a decoration for a cake to show the gratitude towards the doctor and the nurse for the immense work they are doing. What is your thoughts? Let me know in the comment section. I love to hear back from you all. Thank you for watching my video. Hope you love this video and find it helpful. Please do subscribe my channel, give it a thumbs up and share as much as you can. See you soon next time.